over it. And the uh, roof is going to do the same because with a whole lot of people as we've got this afternoon, uh, if there's only one pair of hands working around, it gets rather boring. But if we if we if we both do the work then I think you'll find that uh, it will be more interesting. Now, um, while I'm come on, please do, please come in. Yes, while I'm working around, um, I will answer any questions that anybody wants to ask. And uh, I don't know whether you've got any questions you want to ask, but uh, now is the time to ask them if you have. And uh, uh, so give a little thought to that and uh, don't be shy. So uh, I don't think I've got any more to say at the moment. I think I will plunge straight in and since you're the nearest I will start with you. So just come stand up a minute and just let's move this chair a bit forward because that's right. Now you can just stand up again, if you will. We've still got one or two more people to come, I think. But as for you and me, we can go on working quietly while they're, they're coming. So what you're going to do is you're just going to look out across the room, just planning not to do anything, just to leave alone and allow me to get on with it. Do come in. Very nice. So now, presently, I'm going to invite you to let the knees go and go to sit, but of course, you're not ready yet, so you're not going to do it yet. And what you've got to think about and realize is that as you stand here, particularly with a lot of people watching, uh, you may be inclined to stiffen and tighten. So you're just saying to yourself, well, I'm not going to be bothered by all that. I'm just going to allow myself to be free, free, free. And then we're going to give a little thought this very important question of direction. And what I mean by direction is you're going to move, so in what direction are you going to move? Or put it perfectly simply, which way are you going? Where are you going to? Well, at the back of our minds, we've got this idea of sitting in this chair, which is just behind you. I give you a nudge with it so that you feel it's there and you don't think I've suddenly whipped it away or something like that. So you can be fairly confident that it's there. But you're not going in that direction. You're not going that way. You're going the opposite direction. And the reason why of coming up this way instead of going down that way is because when we move we want to take the pressure off the joints we don't want to press everything down we want to free 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 so you're allowing yourself 
come up towards the ceiling and you let your knees go. Very nice. And having got yourself there now, you find your seat bones. You're going to be finding your balance on your seat bones just in the same way that previously you were finding the balance on your feet. And then uh, you're freeing yourself. Very nice, very good. Let's just move that arm there and let's move the other arm as well because otherwise you'll come in if you want to, yes. There's temptation to drop the shoulders forward and the weight of the arms can be rather a drag. But that's very nice and free there, you see. There is, you're not tightening your neck, you're not tightening anywhere, you're leaving yourself alone, and when you leave yourself alone like that, it all works like that. <laughs> <laughs> and when it works like that, that's great. <laughs> that's the way. Who's next? Are you coming next? Please. Might as well continue to use this chair, I suppose. So, what I always ask of people, first of all, the most important thing is to think of doing nothing. To think of just standing, just standing here and looking out, using the eyes, very important, and just to stand and just let the balancing mechanism work. Very nice. Now, as I say, I'm going to invite you to sit in the chair eventually, but of course, I'm not ready to do so yet, and the reason why you're not ready is because before anything else, you need to just check it out and remind yourself now not to stiffen the neck, not to interfere with the balance of the head, 